Just keep mounting for the flying kangaroo. Now a historic win for workers as the High Court rules Qantas illegally sacked more than 1,700 employees in 2020. One of them, Damien Pollard, worked for the company for more than 15 years before his job was unlawfully outsourced. He joins us live now from Canberra. Thanks so much for your time, Damien. I mean, this was Australia's largest case of illegal sackings. After three lengthy years of fighting, we finally got justice. Yeah, finally. Good morning, Sarah. How are you today? Very well, thank you. I bet you're pr That's feeling pretty great. good too, hey? <laughs> Absolutely ecstatic. It's, um, it's the whole vibe of the thing, which uh, a great lawyer once said. Um, it's just after the last three years of uh, a lot of dark times for a lot of my colleagues to receive joyful calls yesterday. Uh, it, it was just an amazing experience and talking about it now, I think you can hear in my voice just still brings a lot of emotions. Yeah, we absolutely can. I mean, the smiles on everyone's face yesterday was just incredible. Why is it so emotional for you? It's um, very hard to explain. I suppose we hear in the news and we become a little bit numb to it, um, especially during bad times and over the pandemic, you know, people being laid off and we go, oh, that's terrible for those mm. particular workers.